when you share your good news with the narcissist. Normally, people will be happy for you when you share your good news with them. They will see it as something positive, encouraging and uplifting. But this is one thing that narcissists do not like. They hate it when you're happy about something that they are not responsible for. Something that is outside of their control. When you share your good news with a narcissist, they will become rageful. They might be openly aggressive to you. Or if you share your good news in a public setting, they may become passive aggressive. Because deep down they know that their response is not logical or reasonable. But when you share your good news with them, they see it as an attack. As though you are taking the spotlight away from them and leaving them in the dark. Which is why you should not share your good news with the narcissist. No matter how excited you are, no matter what that good news may be, it doesn't matter if you've won the lottery. You should not share your good news with a narcissist. You might not see it as though you're doing anything wrong. You're not saying anything bad about them. But they really see it as an attack. Because it makes them feel inadequate. It makes them feel very envious and jealous. Because they're very insecure. They need everyone to stay down so that they can feel like they're the best. Everyone has to support this illusion and if you dare to stand up straight in your natural position, they see it as a threat. It makes them very envious. It triggers them to reflect on their shame. But the narcissist is not going to lie low with their head down. They're going to do whatever it takes to make you feel the same way. And they will do that by insulting you or giving you backhanded compliments. They will minimize your good news and act like it's nothing special. They will ignore you or they will talk about someone else's good news or accomplishments and portray it as though it's so much better. They will do all of this because they feel threatened by your good news. They feel like it takes something away from them. So when you share your good news with a narcissist, they will always have some minimizing or dismissive comment for you. All they can do is take away from the moment and experience. Because they have nothing to bring to it. They're very empty people. They only think about themselves. They have no regard for your feelings. They will always leave you doubting yourself and thinking that your good news isn't so good after all. No matter how good it is, they will always find a way to downplay it. Because they don't want you to feel good about yourself. They look at it like, why should I give you compliments and praise? When that's just going to make you feel good 
and I'm still going to be left feeling miserable. So no matter how impressed they may be by your good news, they will withhold it from you. They will act like it's nothing special. Even though they may be deeply threatened by it, But they can't let you know what's really going on in their minds. Because they feel like that takes something away from them. And they're very egotistical. They want everything to revolve around them. Which is why they will withhold their attention from anything that does not concern them. No matter how impressive it may be. Because they're very envious and jealous people. They're constantly trying to extract their sense of self-importance from other people. While constantly feeling like other people are leaving them to feel unimportant. Which is what happens when you share your good news with them. It makes them feel inadequate. It triggers them to reflect on their shame. And then they throw a temper tantrum or they act indifferent towards you. Which leaves you not wanting to share your good news with anyone else. Which is exactly what they want. They want you to play down your qualities and abilities. And anything that may be good for you. Because they can't stand you getting all the attention. When you share your good news with a narcissist. They will always find something wrong with it. They will always find something wrong with anything that is good about you. They will find a way to make it all about them. They will use it to play the victim. They will leave you feeling like you're doing something wrong by sharing your good news. When you receive some good news, share it with people who are kind and supportive. Share it with people who care for you. People who can share your happiness and celebrate with you. Rather than sharing your good news with the narcissist who is only going to ruin the moment for you. Although the narcissist may become rageful when you share your good news with them, they feel entitled to know about your good news and they may also become rageful if you do not share it with them. So you really can't win in this situation. Whatever you do could potentially trigger the narcissist's rage because they want to have the opportunity to trash your good news and make it seem like it's nothing. They want to prevent you from enjoying an occasion or event. They want to spoil things for you. So only share it with people who are deserving of your effort, attention and respect. People who don't have to reduce your good news to their level. Because they have qualities, abilities and accomplishments of their own that they are proud of. 
so they don't need to trash yours. They don't need to make you feel like it isn't that great. They have something to bring to you from their own sense of pride and accomplishment in their own lives. Your good news is never going to win the narcissist over. It's not going to persuade them to agree or be friendly with you or to accept and support your ideas. It's going to make them even more resistant and unaccepting of you. It's going to make them angry. So don't give them the opportunity to steal your joy. Be happy for yourself and share your good news with those who are kind and supportive. Thank you for watching. I hope this video resonated with you. Please like, comment, share and subscribe. If you would like to donate, my PayPal link is in the video description. Coaching inquiries, you can email me at coaching.narcsurvivor.co.uk. Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you soon.